this program proudly sponsored by Insegna International Languages Bookshop. Welcome back to Tombador TV and to the last segment of Program 1. We arrive in this segment at our destination, the Victory Hotel in Hanoi. We're getting to the, the modern one, you see? Well, that's the soft yeah. Excuse uh, me. Here it's different. <coughs> yeah, there it is. Beautiful land. Huh? Kim. That's Kim land. <laughs> Lake Kim. People fishing I think the yeah, the one. We're spending quite a bit of time here, but this is where uh, most of the tourist stuff. Beautiful. Actually, too many fishing off the. Yeah. <laughs> so the thing is, Tony, when I film like this, and then you 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 know you're walking around, and you mix it up, it comes out. Oh, well, even jugs. That's a nice park, yeah. Today's uh, is uh, in and manjare and I've got a funny feeling I'm going to Frolare. And you won't see me till tomorrow. <coughs> Driving in a place like this is quite an art, isn't it? You've got to, you've got to do it uh, gracefully with... Uh... Some, some government uh, building there. Yeah, well it's got a, a sickle and... Um, hammer and sickle, yeah. Sick, a hammer and sickle, yeah. So... He's got a, Ministries or something. Yeah, yeah obviously. No guns, Tony, look. He hasn't got a machine gun. Yeah, yeah. Just... I what did you say we're to... far away from this area, though? Something to do with Ho Chi Minh. That's Ho Chi Minh uh, Mausoleum. Is it? Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Fantastic, isn't it? Yeah. Historically, that would be something to see. Probably, probably much. Yeah. So this if is there was a people who, uh, there uh, would be. I wonder yeah. if there's something on with all these red. Uh, right. So there's a Canadian flag. Right. Did you see that Dien Bien Phu there? That is a. Hey, this is uh, there's there's a White Euro House under Euro there. <laughs> There's the European uh, <coughs> flag, you know, the Union. Union flag, yeah. Look at this. Look at all the Vespas. Yeah. It's quite a sight, isn't it? Motorini, big business for Motorini right here, right? Eh? Unbelievable. Yeah. Well, I suppose they've superseded the bike. Which is something. Yeah. At least they're motorised. You know, it's they, all wear, it they all wear the helmet. Yeah. Which they don't do in parts of Italy. The casco. In casco. Yeah, and also a lot of them migrated too. Yeah, they, they still kill each other and they still don't wear them, but, uh, you know, by law they should be wearing them. <coughs> in Italy, every now and again, they have a blitz. 
I've got a mess of stomach real bad. So we forget to take things like a Zantac would be fine or a... a um... An antacid. We're really suffering during the night, I'll give you a... Actually, Telecom uh, Italia has got a lot of contracts in Asia. They do a lot of work, you know, setting up telephone networks and things. Amazing. I think it's fantastic this city. Got a lot of uh thing wood here. <laughs> no, but the car is not predominating any. Here the car doesn't predominate Tony. No. Ha you have to have a road that's that's run Oh, okay. <laughs> so it's not the big buses like, you know, the big tours we've done. Have you seen any? No. And I wouldn't be surprised if that company give us a guide just for us. Yeah. Place oh. where... You know, we're, we're, we're the... Uh... Yeah, well, they all paint stuff. Um, uh, well, you know, I'm being... We're <laughs> getting there, geriatric. I'm being facetious. <laughs> <laughs> I reckon you won't be wearing the shorts very much. Oh my god, oh my god. Remember that, that place? Oh my god. And they refused to have It's trial and error here. <laughs> we'll eventually get you. Get this is uh, very interesting. How about Stoopy? What else would you yeah. say? Would you say anywhere else in Illinois? <laughs> Except for the hotel. We can't win a game. We can't win a game of football, but uh... yeah, yeah, yeah. We've got hairdressers and everything. Look at that. We've got all that. Uh... Oh, well, we've got little restaurants too. Great. Hanoi's weather was hot and humid. However, our taxi ride to the Victory Hotel was very pleasant. The driver was making allowances for me when he saw that I was filming. We settled in our room at 5.05 on the fifth floor. Lucky the hotel's helpers were at hand. I could not go up those stairs without having to stop for air. I am unfit and overweight. The combination of hot, humid air, staircase and suitcases or bags to carry is a real challenge. You have been watching Tom Badula TV and the first program of the new series Vietnam and in a way something that was long overdue because I do travel quite a bit overseas and uh, I do a lot of filming as well uh, of the places that I go to and the beauty of it is that it's real, it's immediate uh, it's done uh, on the run, literally, but we do a lot of um, work afterwards to make sure that uh, you enjoy the footage uh, and uh, you get a new insight in what it is to be a tourist today. So stay tuned. This is a long series. There will be very many programs that will follow. Uh, stay with us. Don't forget, watch TombodulaTV.com on YouTube where you'll also find information about all of our other websites. Uh, there's more to come in the next program. I'll see you then.